and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you how to turn all those jeans in your closet that are too short into some super cool distressed jean shorts. I know, it's a very different video than normal, but I thought why not? We were trying to find these videos on how to turn your jeans into shorts, and oh my god, we could not find any. So we finally found one, and now we are the jean masters. So we're going to share it with you. All right, let's get started. Oh, wait, before we get started, we are going to do a like button challenge. You have to press the like button with your, hmm, pointer knuckle in five seconds. Are you ready? Five, four, three, two, one. Did you do it? If you did, give yourself a pat on the back. Now, let's actually get started. The other day, I was cleaning out my room and I was in my drawers, in my jean drawer that has lots of jeans, and almost all of them were too short, but they fit my waist. And I don't grow a lot, so I actually grew for the first time. Oh my God. But I knew I did not want to throw them away or give them away because I thought I could do something cool with them. So I made them into shorts. And I think they came out pretty good. So I'm gonna show you those right now. So this is a pair of jeans that I'm going to be cutting and distressing. As you can see, these are pretty regular baggy jeans. You can also use tight jeans. It just, I just like using baggier ones first. As you can see, they already have a couple holes in them. So I'm only gonna make a couple more. You will need a pair of scissors. You need a pen so you can mark where you are going to cut. One of the most important things to distress, the skinniest pair of tweezers that I've ever seen. These are the things that you don't need to have, but if you wanna be even more creative, you can use these. You need a, you could use a cheese grater so that it makes like a little bit lighter patches just so it looks like more worn out, or you can use a razor. Step one. You are going to lay your jeans on your table and cut about halfway so that's just easier to work with. Okay guys, this is obviously not the finished product, but right now I'm going to decide, do I want them to be rolled up? or do I want them to be cutoffs? I think I'm going to choose cutoffs because at the bottom of your cutoffs it gets all fringy and you get all those like strings and it looks really cool. And I did that to my other pairs and I really liked how they turned out, so that's what I'm going to do. If you want to do it rolled up, then you're going to have to keep it longer so then you have fabric to roll up so it's not like up to here. You know what I mean? I think I decided where I want them to go. I'm going to have it go like that, but make sure that on the sides it's higher up, obviously not that high up, but like it's higher up than in the middle. And make sure, do not do this. Do not make it the same length as the front and the back or else your butt will be out and nobody wants that. So make sure to make it longer in the back. This is what it looks like before I distress them. It does not matter if it's perfectly cut because I am just going to make it fringy and like super cool and messed up. So it doesn't really matter that much. You can technically leave it like this if you want, but I want to add some like fringe to it and holes and stuff to make it super cool, you know. Now I'm going to show you how to make the bottom all stringy and fringy and don't try to make it perfect because perfect is the opposite of what we want. So now I'm down here <laughs> and you see how on these jeans the lines are going this way. You can see all the string lines going this way. <laughs> so what you wanna do is pull against the lines. So as you can see, I got a couple there and sometimes you want them to be longer, sometimes you want them to be shorter. It really doesn't matter as long as you're getting some of those strings. It may be hard in the beginning because it's kind of hard to get the hang of it and sometimes you might accidentally pull out some of the strings and it's kind of annoying because you just work so hard to get those strings. But it works, so it's really cool. If you 
want to make a longer string, like some of these are shorter, if you want to make a longer one, you just start from further away from the edge and you pull. And if you want to make a shorter string, just start closer to the edge, like this. Okay, so I am halfway done. I have the whole right side finished, so this is what it's looking like right now. Looking pretty cool, right? I think it looks pretty awesome. I mean, it wouldn't be bad to watch your favorite TV shows or Netflix show or listen to your favorite music because it can get boring sometimes, I'm not gonna lie. Okay, so the bottom of the shorts are completely finished. Yay! And after you put it in the wash two times, it will look even cooler. Trust me, now I'm going to show you how to make the little holes. First, you're going to mark where you want to put them. This one already has a couple, so I'm just gonna put mine one right here and one right here. <sighs> no going back now. <laughs> now you're just going to cut along your line. Now here is where it gets interesting. You may be thinking, how am I gonna get the lines to go across? I just did it over here, it's only going down. How is it gonna go across? Here's the trick. All you have to do is pull from the top or bottom and it'll go all the way across. Wow! This is very, very, it's, you gotta be real patient for this. It's kinda hard. You cannot pull too hard or it'll rip it and you don't want that. It's very slow, but as you can see, we've got one little string. Only thousand more to go. You see how we have this little bit of a blue puff kind of coming out? That's from taking all the strings out. All you have to do is snip that off really quick and boom, it's like right where we started. Here's the hole. And you can do that wherever you want or anywhere on the shorts. I'm just going to do one there and there and I have completely finished and it is time for a fashion show. a new video. All right, bye, love you, Mwah. Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you to how to turn your old too short, how to turn your, your, your jeans that are too short, what?